I'm Brett Valentine, uh, the director of Fire on the Hill. Uh, it's a documentary, it's a feature documentary about uh, cowboys in South Central. Um, there's a horse stable called the Hill Stables. It burned down in 2012, and basically the documentary follows um, basically three three cowboys uh, in the wake of that fire um, afterwards. Juan is one of them. Calvin's another one. Fatback's in it. Tang's in it a little bit. But we all just came out here, and we're having a great time at Santa Barbara Film Festival. All right, tell me a little bit more about it. Yes, well, uh, the story is about um, our culture and the way that we live. It's actually uh, true, everything about it. And it was started filming uh, in 2011, and, and the stables were actually up. And then we had a fire there, and then the stables closed, and we contacted Mr. Beth Valentine. And then he said, you know what, let's do something. And... Uh, it's been around for 75 years, and he said we can't lose this, so we're trying to really bring it back and get it up and running in a different manner to be directly an impact on our community. Now, are the stables back? Are they built again, or are they still down? No, it's not. The stables uh, is it's still down, but we are we're starting off a uh, foundation, so we can bring the stables back. So we're interacting, but we just the only thing that we don't have is a facility. So we're doing uh, we, we're trying to get our uh, organization up and running where we want it to be. Because we're moving now, but we're just trying to find different locations and interact with the community like we was doing in the past, but just bring it back bigger and better. And where exactly is the location? Well, um, the location where it was uh -huh. is in uh, L.A., mm -hmm. which is off 131st and Fig, which we call the hill. But right, right now, so if we don't bring it back there, we want to bring it back somewhere in the community, but bring it back better. So we, we want to capitalize. But you want to stay in that general area? Yeah, pretty it was much. right yeah. in the heart of South Central. And this was a stable that was getting a lot of kids out of gangs. And that's kind of what it was doing over the years. And then we're talking about generations of this. So we're talking about back to the 20s, 30s, 40s. And so it's a culture and it's a, it's a way of life that has been there. And that was something that I thought, you know, that we should bring to light because it was something that, uh, it was kind of a, a, a nail in the coffin in 2012 when the Hill Stable went down, but it's not dead yet. And that's what we're trying to raise this awareness with this film. Now we have a Hill Foundation coming up after it, and so we're trying to resurrect it from the ashes, and all of this is helping. Wow. Can you talk about your involvement? Um, well, my involvement was big. I'm one of the um, subjects in the film. Um, we worked um, for a long while with Brett. Um, film is tremendous. It's about three, three um, individuals where we come out and it's talking about our community, how we are impactful, how we help keep our kids out of the streets, off gangs, away from gang violence, uh, you know, teenage pregnancy, poor performance, different things like that. They get to come down to our um, our facility, where, where our, our old facility, the Hill. We were able to get these guys away from the streets, away from the gangs, away from that culture. They were able to come in and embrace a um, equestrian culture in which we call our, our cowboy culture. And they were able to come in, and now we have this Hill Foundation started. We are trying to make and get this thing big, better, and get it going. Nonprofit organization in which we're trying to get our kids off the streets, get some um, some some programs, some facilities, so that we can get these kids off the streets and and, and on horseback. Now, with the facility burned down, where are you dealing with the kids now? Or do you have anything, any place at all? Yeah, right now we're dealing with the kids in Southgate, yeah. off Imperial. It's a um, question center that we stable at, and we have all the youth come out to the stable, mm -hmm. and we're dealing with them right there. Yeah. How many horses do you have? Um, right now we currently work with four horses. Four horses. Yeah, we work you, with four horses. Do you actually teach the kids to ride? We teach the kids to ride. We mentor the kids, and we do a lot with the kids. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I, my name is Michael Thomas. I'm a subject in the movie, and I'm, I'm, I'm an ex-gay member myself. Mm -hmm. So I'm just pretty much teaching the kids what I went through and show them how to be what I wasn't back then and, and who I am today. So, yeah, we're dealing with them on a daily basis. Yeah. That's an amazing story. Thank you Thank so you. much for bringing it to film. Mm -hmm. What do you want audiences to take away from it? Uh, the main thing I, I really want to take on is a, it's a perception. You know, I think everybody has a perception of South Central, and we all and think it's not this. And it's not this. <laughs> and there's much more to it. This and is that's, so cool. And that's what we're really trying to do with the, the film. It's a it's a film that breaks the perceptions, and that's going to be beneficial for everybody. People Congratulations! In the community. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.